Hello all you Thunderific people out there, Thunder AK Chris here, bringing you a tarot part video. Now, I'm sorry if my voice sounds a little crackly, but I'm still getting over a cold I just got a few days ago. Anyways, we're, ta we're gonna tarot part this, uh, ah. PVR box. It's for getting a ah, cable TV. But it doesn't work. So I figured I'd do a terabyte apart video. If the screws would come out. <clears throat> now this might be a, a two or more part video. It all depends on how long it takes. Time to bring out the big guns. There we go. That's much easier. <clears throat> but depending on the uh, amount of views this video gets, it's depending on if I uh, do it again. Now I should warn you, if you're a little kid, do not try this at home alone. Always have adult supervision. But I am an adult, so this is okay for me to do. And I have experience with electronics.
Now, if you want to see something tearing apart on the channel, uh, <clears throat> once I get a P.O. box number, if you want to send something in to be torn apart, if it doesn't work, I can do that. But only if it doesn't work anymore and it's okay with your parents. Unless you're an adult and it's your own item. And you don't want it anymore or it doesn't work. But I learned all that I know about electronics from my dad, my stepdad. <clears throat> That comes out pretty easily. It's just to the motherboard for this. Well, technically the card reader. It comes out pretty easily. But sometimes taking apart some electronics could take some time to do. Mm. 
<clears throat> and sometimes you get parts that just don't want to come off. But eventually everything comes off. It's kind of like doing surgery. You need certain tools to do certain things. Like I said, like doing surgery.
Now, what I'm taking off right now from the front is the USB port. And there it is. Oh, it's off screen. There it is. Just a small little, uh, kind of motherboard looking piece. Now for the display. It <clears throat> it's actually kind of neat. This is the motherboard for the display. Those are two LEDs. That's uh, kind of like a clock with the uh, four numbers. It's kind of like a clock display, which you could probably make that into a clock display. There's chips, uh, capacitors, uh, and other things. That is uh, a 10 volt capacitor. There's a chip.
There are 50 volt uh, capacitors on here. Uh, and all kinds of chips. And that's on the main motherboard. Each one of these seems to be about 50 volts per oh a couple of them are 16 volts these three at the back are 16 volts this one is a 50 volt uh. Sixteen, fifty, fifty. They've got all different kinds of them. The capacitors. But, anyways. I'm running out of time on my camera. <clears throat> Anyways, oh, forgot to show this off. These are coils. also known as conductors same as same with this one but this one this is the first time i've seen this one i can just tell that it's a conductor from the wires But yeah, there's transducers, transmitters, all kinds of things on it. Anyways, thank you for watching and see you in the next video. G good.